Now we are discussing the difference between stack and queue. As we know that the stack is a kind of the LIFO. So here we are mentioning it is a stack. So stack is the LIFO. LIFO means last in, first out. And if I talk about the queue, which is our second topic, so queue is the FIFO, first in, first out. Now, first thing we must know that stack and queue both are the part of the linear data structure. Linear means some kind of line is there and in that line we are going to do something. So stack and queue are the part of linear data structure. Now here we are having two diagrams. One is of book and one is a simple line. So by the help of this we will understand the stack and queue. Let us suppose that uh, first of all we are understanding the stack. The faculty is asking for the assignment or maybe there is a copies which are placed. Let us suppose that these are some kind of copies which are placed. Let us assume that this is uh, roll number 101 who has given its uh, assignment first of all in the copy. Then roll number 107, afterward 109, then 110, 106, 112, then 119, 130, supposingly 140, then 131, let us suppose 113, 201, and the last copy which is given is 205. Let us suppose that these all are the copies which are having the assignments are putting on the faculty table. Now, you know that the first of all, who has given the assignment? We know that the rule number 101 has given the assignment first. So while putting the assignment, this was the rule number who have given the first assignment. So here we have inserted the first. Now if I go with the order of the insertion, insertion means how the people are going to submit the assignment that we are assuming it is the insertion. So here you can see that this is the order like 101 was the first giving then 107, then 109 and up to so on all the people has given the assignment and the last person who have submitted the assignment was 205. So up till 205 was the person who have submitted the assignment. Now we are going to the different thing. Faculty comes. Faculty has to check the assignment. So we are assuming it is the deletion. Now faculty is not going to check out the assignment or the copy which is at the lowest level. No, faculty will come and take out the top assignment and check it. So while deletion, faculty is doing the reverse order. So this is the deletion. During the deletion, the 205 who was coming at the last. So last is having the first priority. So 205 is given the first priority, then afterward 201 is given the next priority, then afterward 113. It is exactly the reverse sequence in which the copies are placed and the last copy which was checked will be 101. So this is the stack. Stack means the LIFO. LIFO means who was the last is given the first chance. So here we know that 205 row number has submitted the assignment on the last and this last person is getting the first chance of checking the assignment. So this one is the first. That's why we said it is the LIFO, last in first out. Means whosoever is coming last will be given as the first chance. Now if I take the normal example in terms of the array, then we can represent the stack like a standing array. So here we have represented a stack and with the help of, let us suppose that these are not the books, these are some numbers. Let us suppose we have started inserting the number with 101, then the next number inserted was 107, then afterward 109, and these numbers are continued going. Let us suppose that another number we are having some of the numbers. Then afterward, we are having 201 and 205. So this is the insertion in the stack. Means starting from 101 to up, we are going to insert. So the order of insertion is going from 
lower to upper side now this is the same order we have represented here while insertion but if i say about the deletion now the top element from the stack will be given the first chance now here while deletion we will go with the reverse order that means 205 will be given the first chance afterward 201 and so on till 101 so that we have represented so that's why the stack is called the lifo last in first out and there are many applications of stack just like we are having the books which are placed into some stack in library or just like we are having the plates or we have to reverse a number so that is called the stack now one more thing the insertion in the stack technical name is called pushing so we say the insert is called push normally entering the number inside the stack the technical name we say push uh, so whenever in the examination they they will say they will say push three numbers into the stack that means three numbers you has to enter into the stack and the technical name of delete inside the stack is called the pop so here is a technical name of the deletion that is called the pop whenever in the examination they are saying to delete something then they will say pop pop the three elements from the stack so this is all about the stack which is a lifo data structure and now we are going to discuss the queue which is fifo first in first out now we are learning the queue talking about the queue we are taking one example to make you understand let us suppose that this is a row and in this row there is a ticket counter where we has to purchase the ticket now this is the place where the people are going to come inside so here we are going to come here from this row this is called the insert now let us suppose from here the people are going and first of all in the 4 am in the morning this was the first person let us suppose person number 17 let us suppose that the number roll number so 17 roll number was the first who come into the row at 4 pm maybe at 4 30 there is a roll number 10 who come afterward then afterward maybe 5 the roll number 20 comes then roll number 18 comes here roll number 22 and roll number 30 so these people are coming into the sequence means the first person who was coming into the row was 17 so we can say that 17 was there now assuming that in 8 am the counter started now when the counter started the first person who was in the row will be given the chance to get the ticket so this we are assuming it is the deletion deletion means that person will get the ticket and come out so this we are saying it is the delete so here you can see that the first person who was coming into the row is getting the first chance so the 17 was a person who was the first here coming to the row and that was getting the first chance that's why we are calling it as the fifo first in first out whosoever is the first person standing in the row will be giving the first chance now talking about this queue we are taking few examples let us suppose we are having a certain row from which the people has to take out assuming the technical terms we are taking so while insertion we can say that if we are inserting these people then obviously the first person who was inserted was 17 then afterward 10 then 20 18 22 and 30 so that was the order of the insertion because the 17 roll number was the first who was entering into the row now if i talk about the delete in the delete also in the deletion there was the same order as per the insertion because 17 was the first is given the chance first then 10 is given the chance then 20 then 18 22 and 30 so while talking about your queue it is a fifo data structure first in first out and your insertion and deletion sequence are exactly same there is no difference just like in the stack it was the reversed but here insertion and deletion both are the same now in this queue we say two terms means whosoever is on the first that is called the head so a queue always contain the head 
so this is the queue in this queue what is the starting place this is called the head head means the top of the queue now at the lower side wherever the people are going to enter this is called the tail of the queue so this last place is called the tail of the queue and we should understand one thing insertion is always at the tail side and deletion is always from the head side well usually we take the example of a snake the snake is there and the snake head is representing which is on the top and then the tail is representing which is at the bottom so q is like a snake whenever we are entering more and more people we are inserting more and more people the tail of snake is going to increase and yes you know that if i has to just remove the snake so from where we have to remove we have to remove from the head so deletion is always from the head so this is all about the queue the queue is the fifo data structure and the stack is the lifo data structure so that is difference between the stack and queue where in the stack we are having the reverse order but in the queue we are having the normal sequence in the queue we are having the insertion insertion always at the tail side and deletion always on the head side but on the stack we are having technical names for insertion that is called push and for deletion technical name is called the for so this is the difference between stack and queue